I'm David Gerard, and this is Pivot to AI. Today, we're about building data centers as fast as you can. So ChatGPT came out in 2022, and the central government of China declared AI infrastructure was a national priority. Local governments came to the party. Over the next two years, over 500 new data centers were announced. Private investors went all in on the data center thing too because government was encouraging it with subsidies. The Chinese data center boom was really a real estate deal. The shine was coming off the Chinese real estate bubbles, so a lot of investors pivoted straight from real estate to AI. Now, you might suspect they might not have put so much care and attention into the AI bit. In a minor hiccup, there turns out to not be the demand for the data centers. Something like 80% of them are not actually in use. The business model was to rent GPU computing. DeepSeek put a knife into that, same way it did into OpenAI. Suddenly, it's about being efficient with what you've got. And so GPU compute is now quite cheap in China, even if it's not the hottest new NVIDIA chips. And data center projects are having trouble finding new investment. A lot of the projects were totally about the subsidies. These are real estate deals. Data center operators would get permits to generate power, then they'd sell the power back to the grid instead of using it in the data center. Other operators would use the project to get state-backed loans, and they wouldn't bother really with the bit where you might expect a data center that worked and was useful. Data center manager Fang Kunbao told MIT Technology Review, everyone I met is leveraging the data center deal for something else the government could offer. The central government of China is still pushing AI hard. They want self-reliance for China and AI, whatever that turns out to mean. The overbuilding is the low end of the compute market failing, and the central government isn't actually so worried as long as they finish the process with more capacity than they started with. The top end of tech is still investing. In 2025, Chinese phone companies will be spending $12 billion on AI infrastructure. ByteDance, the owners of TikTok, will be spending $20 billion. And Alibaba will be spending $53 billion. Chinese companies still want data centers. They're even buying capacity in Malaysia to serve the broader Asian market. They're just not very interested in the cheap local ones. Thanks for tuning in to Pivot to AI. Please do hit like and subscribe on this video. I tell YouTube's algorithm that people like this sort of thing. This is my income now, so please do sign up for the Patreon on the show notes if you like what I do. If you don't have money, that's fine, I don't either. Just forward the video to everyone you know. Thank you all, and bye for now. Mm -hmm.